This is a very new type of game console. There is nothing like it. You play by twisting, shaking, and tilting. You can play in three dimensions, uh, looking all around the cube, and there can be like characters or other objects that uh, go from one uh, screen to another. And that way, you cannot just port like uh, existing games to the cube. You have to like really change them. As you can see, it looks like a 2x2 two two version of the Rubik's Cube. It consists of 8 modules combined together in a way enabling them to be rotated by 4 in a layer. Just like in the Rubik's Cube. Okay, but what exactly is it for? It's actually a very uncommon game console. It's for gaming and for learning. Right then. Hold tight. Modules interact with each other, sharing the game data. As a result, you can see in-game objects literally stepping from one module to another, and thus roaming across the cube surfaces. Do you want to try? Yes. But can I play another game? You can play many different games. We added a Bluetooth module into the cube, connecting to the phone. And now I can upload new games and apps like a charm. It's done. Now you're gonna shake the cube to launch the game. Wow, it's amazing. I know this game, but I never played it in such a strange way. A year ago, my father helped me make reverse engineering to the cube. Together with my father and his friends, we developed multiple game concepts. Some of them are remakes of well-known games, such as Pawn or Labyrinth. Others are completely new games which were never seen before. Even more, you can use it for meditations or just to relax. In addition, we created the developer's tool set to let people create their own games and apps, uploading them to the cube. We believe in great power of human creativity. This is the cube. Wow, cube.